In 1997, Chiapo Lin conducted a series of capsized tests. By luck, we've been lent two special new video cameras, each with a ring of light-emitting diodes. By sensing the images of these diodes reflected by balls on the model, the system could analyse vessel motion in three dimensions. To be sure of being able to force the model to capsize within the short length of tank in front of the video cameras, Chiapo developed a new crescendo wave, a rising and then falling envelope of 17 waves, with two defining parameters, wave period and overall gain. To guarantee repeatable starting conditions, he made a magnetic latch to hold the model while the waves got started. It could be de-energized by the wave-making computer at the same time on every run. Chiapo had made a reliable system for forcing capsize within a short length of tank and with excellent repeatability. Now he could start to systematically explore the effects of changing weight distribution to simulate distinct loading conditions in the full-scale vessel and to establish the capsize threshold in different combinations of wave height and period. Finally, free-floating tests in a three-dimensional freak wave confirmed the risk of particular loading conditions. Chiapo's capsize work gave him a welcome break from his PhD studies, developed a useful methodology and may ultimately save some lives.